Hi folks, in today's video tutorial I'm going to show you how to create the drop-down menu for the map key in the ribbon. I would like to focus on the whole map keys, what was explained in the video tutorial before, and we will start directly from the scratch. So I will create some any 3D model and I like to modify this ribbon. So for now we don't need the downloaded file, map key all. And I like to create my custom ribbon or modification. So you can select here over here in the right mouse button and customize the ribbon. And the system allows to you to create the new tab, for example, yeah, like here, or new groups. And over here in the modeling, I like to create a new group. Yeah, over here is new group. Maybe we can move it a little bit. So select a couple of times the arrow down and you can rename. So you can select right mouse button rename and it will be, for example, whole. Okay. What does it mean? Right now we have created the new group. In the new group, I'd like to place the map keys. So if I will select map key here, you know that we have been spoken about the counterbore, for example. Yeah, so with the selected, I will use the arrow, move the right, and the system will move the map key for the counter bore as I need, and everything is placed here. But right now you can see that I have only the really nice smiles. And you would like to have, or you would like to see the custom button, so you know that it's possible to choose button from existing yeah so we will choose from existing and you can choose what you want or better if it is whole i can simply copy button what is exist here what i can found and i can place so right now you can do it step by step one by one If you will apply all necessary icons for, whole, for all holes, please select the whole group and select new, new cascade. The system will create a cascade button here and you need to drag and drop simply and easy the necessary files or we can say necessary map case and you can arrange. You can see that simply an easy drag and drop. It is not possible to do it all together, but we have a time. Perfect. And right now, if you will select new cascade, you have everything here, yeah? What you can do is select right mouse button here and you can use the rename functionality and you can write what you want. So for example, for example, counterbore. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Everything looks good. And if you would like to change the button again, you can use the paste button image. And same, you can continue. So what does it mean? You will select the whole group. You will create new cascade. You can manage cascade if it is placed up or down. And you can choose the map keys and apply and copy the additional map keys here. For example, for holes. Only for the quick explanation, if you will select the cascade, the system will automatically place the cascade here. And you can see here that is possible to paste button again directly here. So it's up to you how you will choose the modification of the arranging and placement. Perfect. Last but not least is rename the whole group or whole cascade and it will be, for example, like this. Okay, 
In today's video tutorial, I have tried to explain to you how it's possible to manage map keys, visualize the map key as the icon in the tabs, and arrange in the cascade group. I hope so that you like this video tutorial. Please stay tuned and bye bye. Vladimir.